So I'm currently in the middle of a 4K render of a 7 minute, 7 minute, <laughs> wow, of a 7 second uh, little logo sting that I'm doing for the channel because I'm actually gonna, I'm actually thinking about, <laughs> I'm immediately hedging, gonna do something with this channel, gonna start a series of some sort, and so I needed a new logo sting to go with the whole new music and everything, so, um, but it's been rendering for about 15 minutes now, and there's still an hour and 46 minutes left. <laughs> so, <laughs> seven seconds, and it's gonna take two hours on this like super beefed up computer. It's still gonna take two hours. I should probably go take a shower and actually figure out what I'm gonna do in this series. <laughs> It's hot in here. All right, well, welcome to the flip side, guys. Today, has that been said? I don't know, but today is Sunday, Easter Sunday, Resurrection Sunday, and today's church service was so good. And I was thinking about during service today, it's just crazy how my perspective on the crucifixion and, and the whole resurrection story has changed over the years. For those of you who aren't actually familiar with the story of the crucifixion, go to my Reflect channel. It's listed in the description. There's videos about it there. But I just want to comment because it's just crazy because as a kid, you know, you understand that Jesus died for your sins and then he rose again, right? But that doesn't really mean anything to you <laughs> as a kid because um, you just, you don't understand what that actually means. And then the longer you kind of walk with God and learn more about what sin is and what he actually did for me and what you've been saved from, I have daily hope and assurance of an eternal life and of eternal hope because of what he did, of dying and raising and defeating death through that. And it's just so cool. We watched a video today and it just wrecked me. <laughs> it's like a real old music video, which I've seen like a bunch of times. Um, I'll link it in the description. I'm pretty sure I can find it again. But um, it's just interesting because I remember seeing it as a kid. And as a kid, I would always identify myself with the onlookers, with um, those who, who love Jesus and are just heartbroken and torn apart that he's being murdered. But watching it now as an adult, I, I looked at the video and I felt that I identified more with the soldiers that killed him and the people who were mocking him because that that's me that's the reason he's on that cross is because of my sin and because of the things that I do daily and I'm the one who nailed him to the cross and I'm the one who sent him there because of his love for me and that's just heartbreaking and amazing all at the same time that he offers that grace and that peace and that love to the ones who put him on that cross, which is me, which is you, which is everyone. And it's just, when you put yourself in that position and actually watch this video of these Roman soldiers, like, beating on Jesus, and, and you're like, that's me. And it's just, it brings it into a whole new light and it wrecked me. I was just a mess of tears. <laughs> but uh, it's just, God is good. And it's just so cool to know that. You know, we have a God who, who lives and is alive and is just so good. So good. And even when we screw up and screw up on purpose and royally, 
he'll accept us back with, with open arms if we come back. So that's just an amazing truth. And if you guys want to know more about any of this stuff that I'm talking about, check out the My Reflect channel, which is in the description, and there's links of it all over the place. Oh, there's horsies back there! <laughs> Shiny object syndrome. I'm gonna go home, and I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do with the rest of my day yet, but I'm sure we will think of something. So let's go. Hi, puppy! Hi, puppy! Hi, puppy! <laughs> Snazzy as ever, my friend. Look sharp, though. Hey, grandmother, Hi, sister, Uncle Kevin. Hi, Hi everybody. Mm. I like your hair. So you're going to be a... Hi, puppy. Awesome. But the good news is, is that because I'm not going, we're starting to try for baby now. Yeah. So, we're okay, officially just trying. Stay away from the mosquitoes. Yes. Figured I'd get that one on tape. Yeah, we're still going to have Andrew... T <laughs> what on earth was that? I want to meet the dog. What dog? Mackenzie's dog. Piper? Yeah. Piper? Is it Pepper or Piper? Piper. Piper. Piper got a shout out. She's so cute. <laughs> She's huge. She's so cute. You've seen the videos? Yeah, of yeah, course I watched videos. Did you see her, did you see her meet Kira? This. Yes. And Kira was it's not, <laughs> was not very happy about it. I seem to be okay. I got a tattoo. No, I didn't. I just put that in the title so people would watch the video. I know. I was like, birthday tattoo? <laughs> oh, it's her birthday? Okay, we're done. <laughs> Making like super clickbaity titles has been my tattoo. favorite thing recently. I really You're one of those do. people. Yeah. Oh, I didn't get Jake. Oh, Jake. Oh, wow. Get in here. There is gravy here. Any more eggs? That's what happens. You take Any it. more eggs? You're stuck with it. You guys want us to have some eggs? <laughs> On Saturdays Can I wait a little that they took out. But the idea is fantastic, even though it's godless. We saw because almost, uh, and it was in the super, super sad part, and I was crying. And Andrew was sitting next to you. Because that's our tradition. Whenever we go away somewhere and we come home, we get pizza that night. Mm -hmm. that mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But um, when I go to the all-you-can-eat, I can't leave the angle. cinnamon rolls alone. It's <laughs> very dangerous for me. Too. That was very nice. It is now like 5 o'clock. Spent several hours over at my grandma's house. Took a little nap. Watched the Warriors Trailblazers game. And visited with my family for a while. And now I'm feeling kind of hungry. But I think I'm going to go to the gym. I'm not going to work out anything today. Because it's uh, a rest day for me. But I'm going to go. And just go do a little bit of cardio, just sweat a little bit, and uh, stretch. Because I'm feeling very sore all across my body today. I just think that would feel kind of nice. And then come home, just relax for the rest of the evening. Don't have to work till 11 tomorrow. But for now, we are going to head home, put on some pants, and go to the gym. No, I'm still wearing pants. I'm wearing pants that are stained because I'm an idiot. Um, but then we're going to go. We're going to go to the gym. I need to think of like more creative transitions to transition between segments. So I'm just using the hand thing, which I use all the time. Like, what if I watch this? It's gonna be like it's gonna be like magical time travel. Okay, so we're here, right? We're here, but then when I spin the camera around again, we'll be at the gym. See, what did I tell you? It's just it's like magic. It's crazy. That's not the gym, though. That's the gym right there. The gym that I now currently work at, and uh, I'll take you inside, show you around a little bit. It's a ton of cardio machines right here, Stairmaster treadmills. And then over here, you got all your machines, all your upper body stuff right here, lower body stuff, hammer strengths, all over the place. You got a whole cable crossover machine over there, and then you got your free weights over here. And then you got a bit of a circuit room in here with all the spin bikes awesome and then also an aerobics room in here which is where they do like the Zumba classes and things like that and then outside currently in the process of making more of a CrossFit area outside I'm gonna try to pitch in the idea of like turfing this whole place back here because there's really not much back here right now just some tires and battle ropes and jump boxes but uh, I'm gonna try to get them to turf it back there so we'll see but yeah really nice gym I really like it. I am gonna be able to film my workouts here, but I'm just doing cardio today. 
essentially, so there's not really <laughs> anything exciting going on. But I'm gonna get that on, just sweat a little bit, stretch out because I'm feeling pretty sore, especially in my lower body right now, and have legs tomorrow, so I just wanna stretch today, get loose. So I'm gonna enjoy my workout, put on some music, and just relax, and I will see you guys back home. I also forgot that we have to go to the store before we go home. Workout was good, got some stretches in. I feel even worse than when I went, but hopefully stretching will help tomorrow. And you also may be wondering why I just grabbed Special K granola bars off the shelf in the toilet paper aisle. Well, it's the only aisle that wasn't completely packed uh, full of people so I could film. So I brought it over here and staged the whole thing for the sweet transition, bro. Sweet transition, bro. Sweet. Speaking of cool transitions, uh, well, I have a transition, but I don't have a segue. So I was just in there, and I was about back to my car when I realized when I reached up and my keys were not dangling from my mouth like they normally are. And I checked my pockets. My keys were also not there. And uh, so I'm like, well, crap. <laughs> I don't even remember the last time I saw my keys. And so I went back into the store to all the places that I went. I didn't see them. And I stopped by customer service and someone turned them in. So, crisis avoided. <laughs> that that would have really sucked. That would have really sucked if I had lost my keys. I did lose my keys. But if I would have lost, lost them. But somebody turned them in very graciously. And so I have them. I got them and I don't have to stand outside in the rain and try to break the window to my car. Okay, so now we are going home and I think this is actually where I'm going to end this. Nah. Nah. Shield your eyes because of my blatant whiteness, but uh, <laughs> I just thought of a perfect title for yesterday's video and I'm kind of annoyed I didn't put it yesterday. So as I said earlier, I've been like having a lot of fun just putting like super clickbaity titles. <laughs> I like thinking about it throughout the day. Like, what can I call this video? And it's just, it brings me joy, and I think it's funny. Uh, I do it ironically. I don't actually think it's going to drive, like, excessive traffic. I just, I think that it's funny. And it, in my own mind, I'm doing it kind of as a parody of the people who do it. Because I've been trying to make them just really, like, obnoxious. But I should have called yesterday's video, I Got Caught. That would have been perfect. That would have been the perfect title. I'm going to go back and change it and make a new thumbnail because I love it. <laughs> but this actually is going to be the end of my day today. I will film a little bit more tomorrow and then put the vlog up tomorrow night. But, or tomorrow, whatever. I'll put it up soon. Every other day, right? That's what we're shooting for. But I'm going to go now and just relax and take a shower and watch a movie probably. And just enjoy the rest of my night. So I'll see all of you guys in the morning. This goose, totally checking out that goose. I've been watching this for like 10 minutes. Oh, he got nervous. He got nervous. He started way over there. <laughs> Slowly making his way over. Come on, she's not that scary. You can do it, man. She's gotta be confident. Yeah, pick her a flower first, pick her a flower, then take it over, oh, oh, oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh, something's happening. Something's happening. Oh, they're walking towards each other, wait. Oh, I get it. Snap, it's so clever. He's playing hard to get, pretending like he's not interested, and she's like, oh. Well, if you're not interested, then all of a sudden I'm interested. And now she's going to go after him. Oh my goodness. I just can't keep up the, with the goose drama these days. It's just too much to keep track of. I just don't understand. Man, I am so happy that I'm not a goose and don't have to deal with that kind of drama. I mean, being a human, it's much nicer because, you know, you can... You just don't have that kind of drama in relationships at all, so it's just really wonderful. I came in here to film the end of my vlog. Oh. Because people love you. Peace. <laughs>
Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video today. I'm very tired and uh, I'm leaving. I'm gonna go put this video together. And then what should I do, Dad, after I edit this? I have a lot to edit. I Easter was yesterday. I gotta put all that footage together. Easter was yesterday? Yeah. Wasn't it? It was. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you all have a fantastic day. Is there anything you want to say, Dad, before we end the video? Yes. Okay. Is this good? Yeah, that looks great. It does. Right when I get in front of the camera, I forget what I'm going to say. <laughs> Peace! <laughs> That's my music. You're just going to start saying that. <laughs> I'll see you guys on the flip side. No, I'm sure that's like really mesmerizing.